Metallica have done a lot over the course of their careers, and at times have been embroiled in controversy. But when you think of controversy, you'll hardly associate it with the band's all-time classic ballad, Nothing Else Matters. But for one rock star in a new podcast, he says he actually received a phone call from James Hetfield offering an apology related to the song. Before we continue, YouTube tells us we have a lot of returning viewers, and most of you have not yet subscribed. If you could take a moment to hit that subscribe button, we'd appreciate it. Also, stick around towards the end for some Metallica trivia. In a new episode of the Appetite for Distortion podcast, Winger frontman Kip Winger opened up about the infamous Nothing Else Matters video that features Metallica drummer Lars Ulrich throwing darts at a poster of him. Extended behind-the-scenes video shows Lars repeatedly throwing darts at his face, which likely didn't sit well with Kip Winger. But during that podcast, Winger revealed he actually received a phone call, not from Lars Ulrich, but one Metallica frontman, James Hetfield, who called to offer an apology. Winger spoke of Lars saying, He's never apologized, but James Hetfield called me about a year and a half ago and apologized for the incident. James was really cool. James is the kind of guy I can totally be friends with and he was very sincere. It wasn't like he just called to apologize and then blow me off. He's actually texted me a few times. We text every now and then. I don't think Lars would ever call me to apologize. I think everybody was just young kids and they were thinking it was funny. To me, it's not funny to slag off a fellow musician, but who knows? They were just doing what they were doing. I don't know, I can't answer to that. And although Winger didn't get a call from Lars Ulrich, in a 2020 appearance on the Howard Stern Show, Ulrich did express remorse for the incident. He said, in the Nothing Else Matters video, which was filmed at the studio while we were recording the Black Album, we had a dartboard. We'd get Cream Magazine, Circus Magazine, and we'd take posters of people who look particularly obnoxious and put them up on the board and throw darts at them. There's a shot in that video of me throwing darts at Kip Winger. To this day, I apologize when it's brought up in interviews. It was nothing against Kip Winger personally. And as for Winger, although he wasn't appreciative of the incident, he does sound more understanding, and with what Lars is saying, it definitely makes sense. You really don't often hear anything negative about James Hetfield. This says a lot about him that he called to apologize. For those of you that stuck around, I want to get into some Metallica trivia. One question, answer it in the comments, and don't Google. What was the name of the original bassist, and what was the reason for his departure? Drop a comment down below, and don't forget to check out the recommended video on your screen. And if you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe for the latest rock news.